Hey everybody, it's Jeremy with Spirelight Web. I wanted to shoot a quick video about redirects using the Duda platform. And I just want to remind you how important redirects are whenever you've launched a new website for a client. And the reason they're so important is because it's very easy, if you're not intentional about it, it's very easy to lose all of your client's SEO juice when you make a switch to a new platform. And if you think about it logically, basically what happens is that when you launch a new website with Duda or with, with any provider really, but when you launch the new website, the page URLs are usually going to be different than they were originally. Now, even if you're careful to match them up with what the client previously had, more than likely there are always some pages that you left behind um, especially if the cl client site is really old. Um, if it's a number of years old, over time, pages are abandoned or they're, uh, they're not needed anymore. And rather than deleting them, uh, typically the client's just going to, they're just gonna, they're gonna remain even though they're not being used. But Google has already cached all of these pages. And so what you end up with, even if you're matching up URLs, you still end up with a lot of pages that Google has cached that don't translate over to the new website. And when, when Google crawls those, it ends up with 404, um, you, know, you know, 404 page not found errors and it's bad for SEO. Basically that translates to Google that, hey, this, this page no longer exists. And so stop displaying results from it. And that's bad for your client. So uh, you, wanna, you wanna make sure that you, that you give attention to redirect. So here's how to avoid that. Now this this uh, this works if you're going from the same domain to the same domain. If the client is launching a new domain and they need their old domain to translate over to the new domain as far as three to one three one redirects go, then you have a bigger project on your hands, and it's kind of outside of the scope of this video. But for this video, it has to do with same domain um, redirects, and so. Google makes it, or rather, uh, Duda makes it really easy to create these redirects. Here's how I do it. I will go, here's a site I just launched. It's called LifeGate Baptist Church. And what I'll do is I will go to, um, I'll go to Google and I will, I will type in site colon and then the domain. And if you do that and search it, it will, it will give you all of the results that Google has cached. And so well, for that particular domain. And so we see here there's about 24 results and that's not gonna take me that long at all to enter those uh, redirects into the Google, Google into the Duda console here. Um, and so I'll be able to do to get through those. Most of the sites I do are pretty small. If you have a large site that has hundreds of references, it's a lot bigger of a job, but believe me, it's, it's super important that you do this whenever you launch a new site. Just make it part of your workflow because um, you definitely owe it to your client to maintain their uh, search engine optimization when it comes to uh, pages and the caching in Google and other search engines. So it's pretty simple, pretty straightforward. Uh, you're just going to take the, the old, when you hover over any of these links, you'll see down here in the lower left, you can see where those, those uh, specific URLs are. And you can just type those straight in over here. So I could go like this and I could put in a gift. And then I would find the corresponding page on the new site to point that to, okay? If there is no corresponding page on the new site, then I would just send it to the home page because I don't want any dead links. Or right, it's better to send them to the home page than not to have any redirect at all and just have that that page result in a 404 redirect error or a 404 error page not found. And so uh, that's important to give attention to those, but you're just gonna add that link like this and then move on right to the next one and just go work right down the list and get them all set that way. And then of course you wanna make sure you republish to finalize those redirects, but a uh, super important and hope the video has been helpful just to give you a little of reasoning behind the redirects and then show you specifically how I work it into my flow. So you want to do this right away. 
uh, before you launch the site or immediately after you, you launch the site, uh, you don't have too big of a window there to get that done. So you wanna make sure you give attention to that right away. Hope it's been helpful to you guys. Um, appreciate all of you and hope you have a fantastic day. And if I can help you in any way, feel free to reach out to me on social media, send me a direct message and I'd love to help you. Thanks, have a good one.